Okay, hey guys, what's going on? And, uh, it's been a while since I made a video last. Uh, not really for any reason, I just haven't, uh... Well, I haven't really thought of anything to make a video about. I've had homework, and... I've just been, uh, haven't really wanted to. So, here you go. So this is gonna be my new 2000, uh, my new 2019... Yeah, 2019 riding gear. Sorry, the lighting is a little bit weird in here. We'll start off with this. And we'll put these in it, too. And we'll go out front, because maybe the lighting's better out there. I'm not sure. Not much. It's just cloudy outside today, so... I guess we'll just go right here. So, let's start out with these. These are 100%. Uh, it's a pretty good brand. Uh, gloves, just riding gloves. I got green because it matches my bike a little bit. Size extra, extra large, Jesus. So, when you put them together, it says how much effort do you give. There you go. I didn't even notice that actually until I got home since when they were in the packaging, they were like that. So, this is my new helmet. Uh, well, I'm going to start out with these goggles. These are 100% uh, Red Glare goggles. They're not called Red Glare. They're called the Stratas. 100% Stratas. They got this red tint thing. I like these kind because it doesn't look like you're wearing any like sunglasses kind of thing when they're on. But it cuts every glare. It makes you see so much better. Yeah. So those are pretty nice. And then I got this new helmet. It looks really nice. You can't tell it's like a cheap brand, but it is. It's a built. Just, you know, Psycho Giga Production built. Just like my old blue one up there. Old blue one up there. It's built, but it has a big white built thing on the side. So it's a nice, this is a nice helmet. You can't really tell if it's cheap or not. So that's what I like. And it's black. It looks pretty cool. I didn't get riding pants or like anything like that, but I might later. Oh yeah, plus this has a nicer air filter right here. The old one just had like a little piece of mesh, but this is like metal and then a really, really thick piece of foam inside there, so it cuts a lot of the dust. Uh, so we'll go back here and... Oh well, I did get... A new shirt and I'm wearing it today actually it's just a Kawasaki shirt I don't know if it's gonna show up right but maybe you can see it kind of I don't know it's a Kawasaki racing shirt so I don't know if you can see that or not but there you go uh, boots yeah these I'm just gonna take one these are really nice boots I got motocross boots so so this here just put this aside. This is the built, or no, never mind, O'Neill X Rider boots. Uh, they're really nice. I haven't like rode them on the bike or worn them on the bike yet, but uh, from just wearing them around the shop a little bit and kind of getting a feel for them, they're really nice. It's got these little easy strap things. <laughs> Super simple. You just. Uh, Put this little pin thingy in there and yeah, strap it down like that for all of them. So it's easy to do with two hands. But so and then it also has this little guard around this strap on the bottom, so it doesn't like get broken, which I like. I'll tell I'll tell you a story about boots. My big huge boot problem. After after I'm done explaining these, but it's got, it's got this little shifter grip thingy. Has that? Doesn't have that on the other boot. This is the shift boot. No, never mind. It has them on both because this is the right foot. So that's handy. Has it on the other side, of course. But got this little metal toe guard thingy. I'm not really sure what that's for, but it doesn't really do anything. Uh, full leather boot. Really nice. It's got pretty grippy bottom for your pegs and stuff. <laughs> And yeah, so, 
So I'll tell you a little something. So I have, like, my old riding boots are just little built. They're street riding boots. They're zipper ones. They're really short. And so we went to the, went to the store and the motorcycle shop, and, you know, me and my friend John went to get some new gear, and I got, we both got these zipper boots. They're another built one, but they're taller, and they gave a lot of ankle support. I come back here, the third kick on my green bike, which is currently not in here. It's in the trailer over there. Everything's in the trailer. So, what? Th after three kicks, Kickstarter br uh, breaks right through the zipper, and yeah, we went to return them for these, and these don't have that problem, so that was a big pain in the butt, but these should work fine. Shifting in them is going to be interesting, though, since I'm used to just using my ankle. With these, you can't move your ankle, so you just have to use your whole leg. Yeah. So that's it, really, for riding gear. Uh, uh, John got a new helmet. I don't know if that's on his channel or not, but he got a new helmet. It's exactly like that blue one up there. He would have just used that, but that's an extra large because that was mine. And his head is small, so... He got one like that, except it's white with blue stripes instead of blue with white stripes. And he got a couple more things. I mean, not really as much as me, but he got some stuff too. So I don't know if I'll show you that on his channel. By the way, go check him out at uh, John's Adventure. You'll recognize it because that has a dirt bike as a profile picture with him on it, I think. So John's Adventure, and if you're into like guitars and stuff, John's Music Production. So yeah, this thing is pretty screwed up. I will get to that in another video. I have an air compressor now. I, as you know, I was going to buy one, but my dad just told me I could use his. Because it just sits in his garage and he doesn't use it. So he says I can have it until he needs it. So there you go. Like a dummy I am. Like the dummy I am, I broke the hose, so I had to buy a new one. So yeah, that's about it. Uh, for this video See you guys in the next video if you like to give a thumbs up If you're new to the channel or if you want to support the channel or if you just want to subscribe go ahead and do it and uh, Yeah, that's it. So until then have a great day. I'll see you in the next video